Hello everyone, while I'm actually dealing with Sabans who is way up in my ass, well it turns out someone else actually copyrighted during this debacle of freaking Sabans flagging my shit. Well not flagging it, more like just copywriting as much as they can. And talk about if if they were me as a kid and the freaking copywriting is the Bach village I created just to destroy the freaking crap out of. Yeah, that's exactly what's going on here. It's like, you guys have no real reason why to actually do that. But here they are, it's freaking them copywriting and blocking in some countries crazy enough. And just looking at it right now, it's like, wow, they blocked the Super Ninja Steel episode review in some countries. Oh, well, thanks, bastard. I mean, it was doing good. Now, yeah, 104 reviews is just... 104 views is just where it goes, apparently. So, yeah, um, thanks again for that, you dumb bastard. Let me... I'm just trying to make sure. Where is it? Because I'm pretty sure I saw it, and then I didn't, didn't see it. I'm just trying to make sure that I know exactly what I saw before I actually continue on with this video. Yeah, there it is. <clears throat> so... Meanwhile, while freaking damn Sabans is flagging my shit, it turns out that WB had something to say about it, <laughs> about the freaking video. So WB even joined in and been like, oh, well, um, listen, man, um, and let's see, oh, there we go. I'm, I was going to click to actually see what they freaking am saying, and it looks like it's MC for Warner Brothers. DJ? It's like, yeah, you... <laughs> At least it says visual content. That's the good news. It says visual content. Let me just mute it so I can actually see what's going on here. Oh, okay. I see. I see. I see. So, yeah, they got pissed off by that. And, well, the good news is that I'm not going to give a freaking shh about this freaking damn video. That's the good news is that this video doesn't mean anything to me that I'm about to freaking damn delete it. So they copyright the freaking spoiler review of Justice League. And apparently it had a four year life four month lifespan. So that yeah, it's close to four months because I did it in December seventeenth, so oh well. <laughs> it's like it's no skin off my freaking damn back. <laughs> two views. Only two people viewed it. And your idea was hey I'm gonna I'm gonna copyright this video and put freaking monetization on it yeah and I'm like are you a dumbass or what four months and only two views and that's it it's like dude no one's gonna watch that video no one's gonna watch that video and even I would have told you hey usually my movie reviews you don't get enough actual reviews to even care about them. So, for your sorry ass, I feel sorry because, man, ye, man, damn. I mean, the worst the worst thing that you could actually do right now is go to the Wonder Woman spoiler review and copyright that one as well. And guess what? It has zero views! That has zero views! It's like, my freaking gosh, man. Oh my gosh, man. You're just such an idiot, WB. You're such an idiot. So, I, I don't really care. That's the good news is that I don't freaking damn care. I'm about to delete the video, and we're done. We're done here. Fuck you. We're done. And I guess the interesting part is that WB did exactly what Savans did, which is basically get pissed off over a Photoshop photo that I actually did myself. But yeah, it looks like your original video, your original photo, but in the other hand... I photoshopped the Justice League logo inside of it. You didn't do that shit. You didn't do that and you didn't even think of it. So it's like, yeah, for you to try to actually come over here and copyright that video, just because of that, you're a dumbass. And technically, WB's been a dumbass ever since the Flash TV show began. Because they'll continue to flag... Er I'm not sorry, not Flash. Arrow's TV show begin. Because if you freaking do anything that mentions their TV show, they're going to freaking copyright it. And you do anything about their movie. Apparently the movies, 
will copyright your ass too. So good job, WB. You just got rid of a freaking other video. I didn't really care for much for the video. I just was going to allow it to be there. But since you're going to be a dumbass, I'm just going to delete the video. There you go. No more freaky damn whatever for you. And the video's gone. The video's gone. There you go. I hope you enjoy your dumbass idea of being like, oh, and <laughs> I'm just saying this video, the real, real reason why I kept it up is because of what it could do to Sony. You set up the Injustice League slash Legion of Doom in this freaking video, Injustice League. If you're able to actually get it done and do it, that's going to piss off Sony so damn much because they tried so hard, it so hard, to freaking get Sinister, not Sinister, not Sinister Six up and running. They tried their hardest and they couldn't, and because of that, you most likely will get them very, very pissed off because you're able to do it and they tried to do it and they failed. That is the real reason why that video actually stayed up is because of what I just said right now. But since I said in this video, I don't really even need the video anyway. So, good job, WB, or MC, a.k.a. Dumbass. <laughs> yeah, Music Conqueror or whatever. It's like, yes, the Music Conqueror. Wiki, 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 wiki. It's like you would figure the MC of WB, Warner Brothers, would actually be copywriting you for music. Yeah, I mean, that's the worst. That's the worst freaking name you should have you chose, man, for your title. Yeah, it's like, unless you're going to do it for music or audio, you need to step the f down because, dude, <laughs> visual, you, you, you freaking copyrighted me for visual content. And you're, you're MC. Pretty damn stupid. And I guess I'll just end this video by saying how when it comes straight down to it, if I could, it's like, if I wasn't a lowly channel, if I actually did have the cha-ching and the cash, I might actually go against freaking Sabans and make a statement to show every other freaking damn stupid company, stupid whatever, that you shouldn't just copyright freaking videos just for, oh, well, you have to have actual probable cause to freaking copyright. And I would hope that just by my case, it could actually freaking rip a hole in Saban's and make them rethink things, along with many other companies who are like, oh, God, no, no, we don't want this crap. Oh, no. Yeah, make them very scared to copyright people. And that would be freaking damn awesome. But, of course, I can't. And, yeah, it's like, I really want to, really want to actually confront Sabans on this. I really want to confront whoever's the idiot, it robotic or human dumbass who's flagging the videos. And let's just have a conversation, okay? Let's just have a conversation. Because I would really like to understand why you copied the freaking damn videos. Why did you copyright them? Why did you block them in some countries? Because, yeah, I might have used some of your photos, but also actually had something to say and I can't just do the whole thing of where it's like doop -doop 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 -doop, talking about stuff but not really have videos photos to show you to understand derp -derp -derp -derp. just saying I guess one cool side note to say is that of course when it comes to the court case I would most likely get somebody who actually would watch all the videos and know pretty much about copywriting and make sure that I am in the right. Because if I am in the wrong, I will go to them and freaking damn say, hey, I'm using your damn photos so I can make a freaking damn video that actually is kind of getting some press on you. So to copyright me and crap, and it's just pretty stupid. It's like, yeah, that's just... Just one of his, but anyways, if I was in the right, it's like, if I am in the right, then I would have my freaking lawyer do the job. It's like, yeah, he's going to straight up slam him, and for me, I would actually not even be in the courtroom, or I would secretly be there, but no one would know it's me, because that's just how it goes. And, of course, if I did win, I would actually have three options here. I have a few options. Number one. I would most likely go super selfish and get enough money to pay off my student loan. 
that's just number two is just the fact of maybe I'll actually go in there, maybe get a laptop, maybe get a big laptop, a laptop that actually is worth a lot of money. Also get a touchscreen Apple T computer that would be something cool too. I would also because I did some nice little calculations, I would also get six hundred and sixty dollars just because it's kind of funny. It's like, hey, that one guy who said, hey, you could have made that over a year. I would actually get that. And it's not going to be anything very, very horrible because I would just use that money to buy freaking Power Ranger figures. <laughs> it's like, yeah, I did freaking, it's like, hmm, they had six waves. There's usually five figures in a wave. So, yeah, um, did, 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 did. <laughs> yeah, and $22 because, well, you could say $21 is some change, but eh, right, might as well round it up. Yeah, that's basically it, and then, of course, well, my lawyer needs to be paid, so everything I had to do to get to this point and win, everyone's going to get paid from this, too. Like, yeah, so the lawyer gets to have his payment from all of this, whoever else was involved will have their payment, too, and that's just how it goes, and hopefully, Sabans learns a lesson, they back the fuck off, and they'll stop actually comp stop copywriting people's stuff, heck, maybe it'll just start a trend of... People are being afraid to copyright. So that means lots of people now who are going to copyright are going to have some freaking hesitant moves and we're like, <laughs> because that's what they kind of do to need. They do deserve that, where it's like they should be afraid. They should know something about fair use, what that means, and they should actually make sure and triple check before they actually just be like, uh, copyright. You know, just like that quick button press. Like, yeah, it should not be a quick button press. It should now be button press, hesitant button press, stops before he presses it, checks one more time, hesitantly press the button, checks one more time again, and stops and checks one more time again, and then finally, after actually saying, yes, I think we do have evidence of you copywriting, he now presses copyright. There we go. As for visual content, visual content, I already dealt with the cool part is like I'm not actually uh I'm not actually like uh new to this. I know exactly what happens with copyright. The fact that sometimes they actually piece in exactly where they're copywriting and it's like ah okay okay sure. And sometimes it's complete bullshit. Like freaking Disney one commentary. Well, two commentaries actually got that crap, and it's like, well, I don't give a crap about your vi freaking damn music, and for it to be in there in the first place was a freaking damn error. I wish I could actually have, like, uh, you know, the high-tech stuff, where it's like, oh, I'm able to actually look at all the tracks of music and sounds and able to actually silent one. And it's like, ah, so there's the movie one. Silence it 100%. Now it's just me talking and looking at the video instead of you being a bastard, being like, oh, I got a nitpick and listen in. You dumbass. <laughs> it's like you freaking dumbass. But anyways, yeah, that's basically it. I know I droned on, but that's exactly what happens if I could actually have got a freaking lawyer who was cool and actually fight for me, win, and then these are my freaking damn <clears throat> terms. <clears throat> I also might actually make them say, make them to actually give me the deal. So it's like, oh, well, now ain't we kind of ordain you in Power Force, aka they'll give me free stuff. <laughs> yeah, so it's like, yes, free stuff. Yes, I don't care. I don't care if you give me the Fisher Price clap, you know, school crap. I don't care about those. Give me new stuff that was actually from. Power Ranger figure line and stuff like that. It's like that. I don't care about. I just care about Boom Comics more than anything. It's like, yeah, if you're able to hook that up, I will be very, very pleased. But, hey, whatever, anyways. Oh, man. Copywriting people. Why not?